again, you just wish these Winnipeg fans were a little more excited. Yeah, no doubt about this. I've never seen a playoff atmosphere for the first game of the season. And oh, Dustin Bufflin set the tone right away. The 33 train just took down a Blue Jacket and took him down hard. Bufflin. Bufflin fakes, tries to go cross ice to Stuart Bufflin. Hey, this didn't take long. And good old Dustin Bufflin's right in the middle of this one. He started it off very first seconds of the game. First game here in Winnipeg and Bufflin. Bouncing puck and right off the draw came off the skate to Versteen. Bufflin claims another victim as he's done a few times tonight, and it was Chris Ponger that he knocked down, and the fans love that. Well, at this point, if you're Dustin Bufflin, you sit to the line, but not out, and now deflected. Here comes Bufflin. Short handed. Bufflin scores! Sometimes it's just easier just to knock him over than, uh, you know, chase him around. And amazingly, everybody gets up out of that yeah, line. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> control the puck. He's trying to get control of it, and he never looked up. And when he finally looked up, the power play it looks like. Oh, wow. man, at full speed, that is just wicked. Buffman just Whoa. went Brendan Gallagher. And One of the great rushing defensemen, Drew Doughty, and look at him go, although it comes to a rather unceremonious end as he ran into Buckman. Is a unique talent, a unique player in the NHL. Oh, my goodness. Buckman. Taylor's Luke Gazdick. Once Bufflin gets leverage on it, you're done. You can pretty much do what you want, when you want, when you're six foot five, 265 pounds. Bufflin just with one arm, even off balance, can just throw you into the wall. You'll get it back into the wheel. Huh? Scores! Wheeler has Bufflin alone in front. Scores! Bufflin and Ahudovan scores! And the Blues get it over. Dustin Bufflin will get it out. Over the line, Bufflin right to the net, he scores! OT winner, Dustin Bufflin! He just wants to make a difference. And man, in overtime, he just took control. You're gonna take your shots? Everybody trying to figure out how to attack. Big Buff calls his own number 33. Wins it in overtime. Not bad for a defenseman. Ha! What a game breaker Big Buff is. Edge in the dressing room makes everybody feel at home. You, you know, you just you feel very comfortable. And a wraparound goes in. Likes to join the rush, and he is a highly skilled guy. And beautiful hands there from the big man. Wow, sweet hands for a guy that size. Great skater. Not met with a shot. That was blocked away. And now Buffalo. Paulson went right back in and it goes in. Uh, maybe the defenseman cannot not the stick. Far point. That didn't work out. Oilers hustle in a change. Bufflin's got some room, drops the shoulder, cuts in front of the net. He's got a two-on-one, he keeps, fires, hoo-ha! Let's go right away, the Winnipeg Jets stay on the puck, and Bufflin, look at him pull this thing behind him. Holding off, Dano, 
pulling it right behind his feet, behind Yemelin. Got the strength and the eye-hand coordination to put that stick down. It up, and the big man comes down the wall between the legs. Short side tucks it. For a big man to pull something like this, there it is, around Dennis Weidman. Bad angle and bad post cut. Here's a chance to begin his saddle back in. He is rocked by Buckland. But Dustin Buckland puts the Jets ahead here late. 2 1. Getting across to Ehlers again off the stick. Loose. Score! Dustin Buckland has tied the game. Corralled it. He takes his shot, bounces to Lino Perry. Scores! Corey Perry scores, and then Buckland hammered him from behind. At his best in it. It's an eerie feeling when you're waking up on the bench and you're the only person with a white sweater on. Here's Hall walking in. Checked by Buckland. What a hit by Buckland to deny Hall. Big Buck right through the body. And Buckland wasn't having any of that. Stops, puts the shoulder into him, sends him for a ride. On his knee. Oh, and then Clay Boo was absolutely blown up. Zanek eventually wins the puck, and then he is tattooed by Bufflin. Timber. What a solid hit on Eric Zanek by Bufflin. That will send you upside down in a hurry. going to hit you, you're going to go down. You see the defense from the Jets step up to make it. <laughs> changing type defenseman. He puts people in their seats. He brings them out of their seats. He is an all-around player to watch play the game. Big hits. Routinely ragdolling two opponents at a time in scrums. He's got one in each hand and just say, guys, you're not going anywhere. Like a Chuck to steal a back though, and the rookie will wheel out the center ice. Knock Chuck, he just stands up on the solid play. Has woken up this building. Went off his stick, he's hit by Bufflin. Now watch, he'll get hit here. That's a that's a Ooh. left elbow right to the jaw. Like he's a Bantam player. That is just, and he went immediately to the bench. Back for Jordan Nolan. Nolan had a breakaway. Oh, and now Nolan gets the right shoulder away. To the penalty box, there's the right shoulder. Dowdy winding it up. A couple all-stars going against each other. Looks for the poke check, finishes with a body check, and then throws Andre Kopitar, who's a big, strong man as well, into the boards. Oh, and he just barely missed the target. Cleared in behind as Buckland was challenged by Pajula. Now they're going to have a little tussle. Pajula tried to check Buckland, who got the better of that exchange. Now they're chucking. They're, now they're chucking. Buckland has gotten a couple of laps in. And the official's trying to get him set. And wrestling around in the now corner. Now has got to hold a lion egg. That brings both. Kick to the ice. We saw the history back a couple of seasons ago. It was bubbling at the end of the first. The gloves are off. Jamie Benn and Dustin Bufflin. I'm not sure many would have picked this as a as a match. Well, Ben's a tough customer. He's got a couple in, but Buffett...